Jets at Colts. Colts minus 10 and a half, total 46 and a half. The Colts are 4 and 1 against the spread in their last 5 games. And this whole Mike White thing has really shaken me on the Jets. I I mean he was he was awesome against the Bengals. I do think that the Colts are a really good team. I say really good. That maybe that's pushing it a little too far. I do think the Jets can hang in this. Like the the mentality of this team, they have taken on that mentality from their coach. Robert Sala has been pretty good. Like the Jets have been blown out in some situations, but man, he's kind of got them turning a corner a little bit. They feel like they can play with anybody. The Colts, I think they're going to win the game. I don't think they win it by by more than ten and a half. So I'm going to take the Jets here. Uh, because I think that this team is feisty, man. I think that they can they can put up some points, and even without their quarterback, I still think they're going to be all right here. Uh, because I think Mike White's all right. Like I think he's pretty good. So give me uh give me the Jets plus ten and a half here. Yeah, I'd, I'd take the Jets plus ten and a half. We've got a shitload of games, dude. Yeah, no, we we have got a we've got a few. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.